Uh, hi, you guys can hear my blog this time and see me, which I guess is probably not at all spectacular. Today I was thinking that I should probably do a voice test over Skype, um, just in case, you know, we want to do some podcast things, maybe check it out. And, you know, as I was thinking about that, I thought to myself, hey, why not do a vlog? That way we can do both. Uh, voice and video testing. So here I chose the wrong, wrong day to make a vlog or a video blog or whatever you want to call what I'm doing right now because I got the worst haircut in the world yesterday. I mean, maybe you can't really see it. I'm a little far away, but it is spiky and there's this weird cowlick thing going back here and this is the worst part you can see the skin for my head now granted this is what I looked like back in my Naval Academy days you know really short hair you know I wore a hat all the time so you didn't really want to deal with hat hair or anything like that I mean well it's mostly what I looked like the hair anyway I was probably a little bit more bony and all that uh, but now, you know, I like to go with sort of a not too short haircut, you know, I mean, not like hippie long or anything crazy like that, no mullets. Um, but, you know, I like to, you know, keep things looking professional and, you know, she went in there with the razor and just went and then the worst part is, and this is really when I should have known it was going to go bad, was when she was like jerking. It wasn't like a smooth like, you know, like they normally do, it's sort of like, and I'm like, oh, this is not going to go well. So here I am, this is, so here I am, this is, you know, hey, might as well record a video today. I don't know if you heard that, that was my droid phone alerting me to the fact that I need to do a speed test because today, uh, for my thesis, um, uh, I'm doing this bandwidth test and uh, actually dad is helping me out right now. Uh, he is on his iPhone. And, the same time that I'm doing this right now, he probably got the same exact reminder. Uh, he's gonna we're gonna use an app called speedtest.app, um, which you cannot see on here, uh, to test the bandwidth um, for the mobile phone. And this is actually a, a pretty pivotal point in my thesis, and so I thought I'd collect some real world data. And uh, Dad's helping me out with that. So if you'll pardon me, I better uh, you know. I actually, I've been making some good process on progress. Process. I've been making some good progress on my thesis. In case uh, you guys have been wondering what's going on with that, I don't know if you know, but sort of a false start there. Working on my thesis last year, and then this year got off to a really slow start. And uh, but I've actually been making some really good leaps forward um, on just the bulk of work that I've had to do. And so, you know, I'm really looking forward to getting that done here very shortly. I, I think that the first draft is going to be done within the month, and I'll probably defend in September, uh, hopefully as soon as the fall semester opens up and then, and then graduate right away. So it depends, you know, on how these experiments go and that sort of thing. Uh, I got 0.81 megabits per second, in case you were wondering. Right, get back to it here. So uh, Jackie is gone now, she's out, uh, which means I'm home all by myself with Dog, who you can't see. He's actually right here. I'm in my office right now and he has his chair over to there and I can't really reach the camera so I can't show you or anything, but uh, she's gone and you know we like to do fun things uh, when she is here. So actually last weekend uh, we went to the Seattle Mariners game. Uh, I think that's the third or fourth one that we've been to while we've been out here. Um, Jackie and I, baseball is one thing we can both get on board with, which is really sort of nice. Um, you know, she doesn't like football at all, and uh, I mean, her very limited exposure to lacrosse is, you know, she doesn't really get excited about it, even though I love lacrosse. Uh, and since we're not on the East Coast, I mean, you're not going to find lacrosse here <laughs> anyway. Um, so we went to the baseball game, and uh, it was fun. Uh, we lost. We were playing the Detroit Tigers, so that was kind of a bummer. Um, but we did eat very well. That's one thing. I sort of sprang for the lower deck tickets. Um, you know, and uh, actually two things happened as a result of that. One, we ate a lot better because the food court on the lower deck is much, much better than what they have on the top, the upper story deck. 
Um, but the second thing that happened was we made this huge rookie blunder. We thought, oh, it's a nice day, you know, it's you know 70 degrees outside and it's not raining, which is sort of strange for this area. You know, we might as well go ahead and, you know, give it a go for, uh, you know, we're just wearing shorts and t-shirts and, uh, you know, we did not wear coats because the forecast said it was going to be nice all day and we didn't anticipate two things. One, you're on the lower deck, you don't get any sun. You're, you're in the shade because the upper deck's above you, no sun at all. So that's cold. Two, wind in a stadium, I mean, I, I'm not sure how it happens, but this wind just kind of, you know, circles around in there. So. It turns out, so here we are, no coats, you know, we're thinking beautiful day, everything freezing. I mean, Jackie is just cold, so we ended up having to blow 50 bucks on, you know, like a Mariner's plush blanket so that we could stay warm. It was a complete bummer. <laughs> and so we will not be making that mistake again, um, you know. Actually, I've just broadened my horizons out to paella. I'm thinking that I'm going to make paella my specialty dish. Um, you know, I just really like the fact that you can pretty much put anything into it, all the stuff we love, fish, you know, meat when Jackie's not around, or separate meat dish for her, you know, and then you do this sort of broth and this rice and it all cooks together and it's really, it's an outdoor food. And I love to barbecue. I mean, you know I love to barbecue. So, uh, I, I'm thinking paella might be my, my specialty. You know, especially with Jackie being a vegetarian, you have to have a really good specialty that, you know, she can eat. I mean, I mean pescatarian, technically, all the seafood and stuff in there. Uh, so, yeah, I think it's going to be really good. We'll try to make, I'm thinking maybe, like, my special will be, like, a Old Bay sort of crab style. Uh, I think that might be the way to go uh, with my paella. So, I actually did my first paella on Sunday night. Um, so it was previous weekend, and it turned out really, really, really bland. And uh, Jackie actually gave me a huge co compliment. She's been to Barcelona, and uh, you know she said, "Oh, it tastes like the paella I had in, in uh, northern Spain." And I was like, "Well, great. Apparently, northern Spaniards don't like spices." <laughs> um, I hope so you enjoyed this sort of different format on Bankfruit.com, and uh, really. Let me know what you think about this. Um, I'm, you know, Bankfruit.com actually hasn't changed dramatically uh, since the time that it changed dramatically when we went from sort of the static site to the WordPress site. And um, I know Christmas we talked about a few things to do with the site, but you know, I want to incorporate some sort of new content modes and you know, better structure the website uh, according to the suggestions that you guys gave me. So. Specifically, let me know what you think of this, uh, the vlog and my voice and how I look on camera. Um, you know, leave a comment. I, I don't know why we stopped commenting on bankfruit.com. Uh, I've been trying to drum up some comment support. You know, we got 10 comments on, on uh, Jackie's last post. It was mostly Jackie, me, and Chris that were commenting. But, you know, put some comments down here and uh, we'll talk about this and uh, see what, you know, what we can do to improve this. So. Uh, yeah, that's it.